A march passed to commemorate the World Press Freedom Day. Print and electronic media institutions have taken part in the 2023 celebrations. This year's theme is Shaping a Future of Rights, Freedom of Expression as a Driver for All Human Rights. Invited guest, Information Minister Chushi Kasanda has toured different stands on the sidelines of the celebrations in Lasaka, but she has a concern. Government, however, wishes to express concern at the apparent lack of consensus among the media fraternity over the issue of media self-regulation. I must be quick to stress here that the issue of media self-regulation is entirely your issue to decide. As the media fraternity, you are better placed to decide how you want to regulate yourselves. All that government can do is encourage you to move as one on this issue. And the Media Liaison Committee has called for an end to the harassment of journalists. May I also request that the government expedites the enactment of the Access to Information Bill into law. Meanwhile, stakeholders have called for the protection of press freedom. The media also helps expose wrongs such as corrupt activities, thereby promoting good governance and saving public resources that would otherwise go to the pockets of corrupt individuals and unethical organizations. Meanwhile, veteran journalist Franklin Tembo Sr., who launched a book during the commemorations, has emphasized the need for training among media practitioners. People do not become journalists simply because they own computers. That doesn't make them journalists at all. There is much more to this profession, much, much more to journalism than computers and laptops and smartphones. Fortune Maleta, ZNBC News, Lusaka.